Hey everyone, my name is Kristen and I have lost 112 pounds using a ketogenic lifestyle. I think you thought I would never post another video, but you're wrong. Here I am and I'm going to give you an update of what's going on in my life and how I have stayed keto during some really trying times. So stay with me and I'll be right back. Hey everyone. How's it going? So I haven't made a video in a couple months, maybe a month and a half, and a lot has gone on in my life, but I have stayed keto. So I'm going to give you an update of what's going on, and then I'm going to show you my first grocery haul in my new house. I have been working a lot so that I could get into my new house, and I've been a server or a waitress person at a restaurant and I've been doing that a lot. And then I have my daughter who is on the autism spectrum and she can't go to public school because of the virus. She can't go to a private school because they don't have a space for her. So my 10 year old daughter is not in school right now and I'm working full time. So that has been very stressful. And then on top of that, I got shingles. For the first time in my life, first time in my life I got shingles. So, um, and that was really painful, still is, I'm still dealing with that, but it's a lot better. I'm taking medicine and working and taking care of my daughter and moving. Um, I'm in my new place, which is really exciting and it's gonna be a little bit easier to make videos. It's been kind of hard. And during all that though, I've stayed keto. I've lost 112 pounds since July 12th, 2019. I've been keto for 14 months and I plan to stay keto forever. I am going to show you my first gro grocery haul at the new house. I'm also going to add in some of my grocery hauls from before I moved because I still did videos of my keto hauls even though I didn't feel good and I was trying to take care of my daughter and moving. So I'm so excited to be back. I hope to hear from some of you in your in the comments. I have been watching you, but I've just been kind of passively watching. Haven't really been commenting, but I've been trying to keep up with videos. Um, still full keto. Sometimes I eat 2000 calories. Sometimes I eat less, but I plan to lose probably another 50 more pounds and I continue I will continue to upload on my channel now that I'm in my new place and things have settled down a little bit more. Um, my daughter won't be in a school placement yet, but we have our own place, so that'll be helpful for her. So anyway, without further ado, here is my latest grocery haul and leave me a comment. How are you doing? Um, everything good with you? I look forward to catching up more with all of you and Thanks so much for watching. If you like what you see, please hit like, subscribe, ring that bell, and I'll get you'll get notified when I upload. Thank you so much for watching. All right, bye. So today I got some new um, order from Amazon, a new order from Amazon. I got the double chocolate high key brownie bite cookies. These are my absolute favorite cookies that are keto in the world. So I got those and then I got the peanut butter perfect keto cookies to try and then I also got the high key protein cereal I like the keto cookies not as much as I like these but I like them and I'll be a good break and a treat I like this to start when I start eating it but it has an aftertaste I don't really like so maybe I can put that in yogurt or something but it wasn't my favorite and the macros are the carbs are pretty high on these well it has a it has a lot of um um sugar alcohols but it i'm i'm glad i got my hair cookies so i'll offset it with these i'll keep trying the high key protein cereal but wasn't my favorite i'll try it in some almond um milk but and i've also never had almond milk before so that'll be something new so that is my haul from amazon today all right, my friends, here is a huge, massive Walmart grocery haul. I have not done one of these in a long, long time. I needed absolutely everything, and it's dirty keto, it, it's dirty keto, it's clean keto, it's everything. So 
I'm gonna start with chicken breast. We are going to grill up some chicken, chicken breast. And we got, I think this is almost five pounds. So he'll grill that up and I'll, we'll make chicken salad. I'll make salads and put chicken on it. And that'll be a couple of dinners. I have petite broccoli florets. This is clean keto. We love these Brussels sprouts, the sea salt and cracked pepper. Brussels sprouts, they are so good, especially if you fry it up with butter. We got two of those. Um, my kids love these Vermont maple. This is dirty keto. It's two carbs per serving, but I'll eat some of those too. Um, we got fully cooked bacon. We love our bacon. There's four right here. I got some enlightened one net carb mint chip. I've been really digging this lately. And it has 11 total carbs per serving. I usually do half a container at once. So I got two of those and one of the peanut butter fudge. Love those. I got ground beef for taco meat. I got these creamy parfaits to try. Um, I've been eyeing these for a while. These were not at Walmart. Those were at Market Basket, but I got them anyway. We had, only had to get a couple of things at Market Basket. I got this small shrimp to make shrimp with. We got a bunch of different bangs. Um, these are cheaper at Walmart. I found I like Walmart because everything for keto is cheaper. I love the Marie's Chunky Blue Cheese. I got the Mexi Melt. This is my favorite cheese to make taco salad with. And I got that. We got the broccoli with cheese sauce. This is, let me see here, how many carbs? Um, it's one cup is 50 calories. A full container is 130. I don't see the carbs on this. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Seven grams, two fiber for per serving. So this is pretty heavy in carbs. I probably won't eat that, but other people will. I got lettuce. I got... Hearts of Romaine, sharp cheddar cheese, sugar snap peas, love these. These are higher in carbs. These are four net carbs, but for a treat, I like those. Pepperoni, Diet Coke, we've already broken into that. More Mexi Melt. Um, Kerrygold butter, the Irish butter, two sticks of that. Rain, um, instead of that. So Black Label, that's my favorite. Bacon. I got one, two, three, four, five, six of those. Um, strawberries, uh, tomatoes. Super creamer was at Market Basket too. We only need a couple of things there. Blueberries, yogurt. I love the Faye. This is keto friendly. I get the Faye, five percent. It has six carbs and which is fine because you're supposed to subtract half of that, so it's three net carbs. Daisy sour cream, we're gonna refill this thing because we like squeezing it out. And we got the big one, they only have the big ones, and then we got the small one at Market Basket. Coffee, French vanilla is my most favorite coffee in the entire world. I got the six pre-cooked hard-boiled eggs, hard-boiled eggs. I love these cheese wisps, the bang. Uh, a four pack of the unicorn, rainbow unicorn. Slow roasted roast beef, a cucumber, a Marie's Ranch, more bang flavors, um, Tostito salsa, chili ready tomatoes um, for our taco meat, Angus beef, Oscar Mayer. Some of this is dirty keto, but it works for us. I don't eat these. My kids do the carb mission, carb balance mission. They go through these a ton. Um, eggs, Diet Coke, um, Powerade. We, this is all stuff. This will last me a couple of weeks. We'll get probably six meals out of it mostly. And then I also bought a ton of non-keto stuff that I'm not showing you for my kids. And so this is my grocery haul, my huge grocery haul. We spent about $400 today on keto and non-keto. I'm going to say keto was probably $250 worth. So that is what I got. 
Okay, so it's a week later and we had to do a smaller grocery haul and I'm gonna show you what I got. All this is keto. I am dirty keto. I try to be as clean as I can, but it is what it is. And I love bacon. We go through a ton of bacon. So I got um, five packages of the Black Label. That's all they had. Um, and then some of the fully cooked bacon. So if I don't feel like cooking it, we got shrimp. We made this awesome garlic shrimp, or Jason made an awesome garlic shrimp. So we got that. We got some golden turkey breast. We got a ribeye. He's gonna cut this in half and then grill it because it's too thick for us. And we'll have that for dinner tonight. We got some of this sausage at the McKinnon's Market near us. And instead of, you know, crappy McDonald's sausage, we're gonna have that. I love root beer, ginger root beer, Zevia, Mexican four cheese, um, cheese, shredded cheese. I got this, this is definitely dirty. It has a little bit of trace of sugar and a tuna salad and egg salad, diced tomatoes for my um, taco seasoning. My vanilla super creamer, that is a must have for me. Um, cage free, high cook eggs. Um, I got one bang, they only had one of the kind that I like. I wanna make a jello salad. So I got some cottage cheese, I'll strain that and then put the jello in and heavy whipping cream. I've seen some people do videos on that. We got some American cheese at Market Basket. We got some fresh ground sirloin. Um, he's gonna divvy that up and we'll have that for hamburgers and also for taco meat. I got some leafy greens for a taco salad. I got my Faye yogurt and I also have my Diet Coke. So this is just, this is probably $100 worth of stuff to get me through the week, all keto. I've lost 112 pounds. This is from Market Basket and also from McKinnon's. And then previously you saw my haul, keto haul from um, Walmart. And then I also got a ton of non-keto things that I don't eat but I'm not gonna show you that stuff because this is obviously a keto video. All right, thanks so much. Thanks for watching, bye. So that was my grocery haul. Um, I just wanted to let you know that none of this would have been possible, me moving into my own place with my boyfriend, um, working, none of it would have happened if I hadn't have found the keto lifestyle and started the keto lifestyle 14 months ago. I am super grateful to keto and I am going to stay the course just like I have, even though I haven't been put, putting up videos. I have been keto this entire time and I plan to stay that way forever. And it's all possible because I did change my life and lost 112 pounds. All right. Thanks so much for watching. Hit like, subscribe, and ring that bell. I'll see you in the next video. All right. Bye. When we wake birds and see the sun side by side our fears are done all the good times just begun